welcome back to the channel guys and today is not a regular pvp gbl video wherein we are going to show you a bunch of battles or uh, pokemon battling out with each other rather today we have a shoutcast for uh, the tournament uh, hosted by pvp hq and if you don't know what pvp hq is it's probably one of the biggest pvp pokemon go server of india and uh, what they are doing is they are hosting season 6 of their battle frontier and uh, this time season 6 is the cliffhanger edition so if you want to know more about the tournament uh, you can uh, join their discord server however i'll be presenting you with a bunch of details that you would want to know before uh, you go through the entire message of uh, the rules and announcement so what we have here for you today is a, a basic walk through of their uh, newly created website so they have a web website wherein you can create your profile update your elo and they have bunch of other features like uh, uh, indian gpl leaderboard bunch of details about their other uh, tournament formats so we'll be going over uh, some of those uh, but uh, the topic for today is battle frontier season 6 so i'll try not to get sidetracked a lot and uh, speak a uh, speak bunch of detail about other stuff um, but yeah I, i would highly recommend uh, to check their video out uh, the guy who owns uh, Uh, on the server side he's doing a really hard work to uh, build the server build a community and then now uh, build a website wherein you can update your profile and uh, yeah bunch of bunch of stuff so i cannot praise uh, the guy uh, more than i ever could um, but yeah the tournament is a city v city tournament i'll go into the details uh, later but uh, but yeah if you if you want to join uh, the tournament as a team captain uh, you the registrations are open and i'll show you how to do that and if you want to participate as a player uh, you do need to set up your profile and other uh, to bunch of other things which i'll also do uh, i'll also share the details with you um, so stick with us towards the uh, till the end if you want to uh, know more about the tournament or know more about bvp hq and uh, before we go into those details if you are new to the channel and you like the content uh, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button we are closing in towards 1000 uh, subscribers and uh, your subscribe uh, will help us a lot uh, motivate me to make uh, more pvp content and uh, yeah without further delays let's start with how you can register for uh, pvp hq battle frontier season 6 So if you want to register for uh, the Battle Frontier season 6 or you want to know more about PVP HQ Discord server uh, the first thing that you would want to do is uh, go to their website pvphq.in and you would want to make your profile uh, but before that I'll uh, just do a basic walk through of uh, of the web page here so uh, first thing that you might want to do is uh, you might want to join the discord because that is where your profile will come from uh, so i since i am already on the discord server so it will route me back to their uh, discord but uh, otherwise if you're not it will prompt you to join so it's it's a good thing to uh, join their pvp hq discord server because uh, it's it's very it's it's pro- like I, i'm enhanced on is the biggest pvp uh, server for pokemon go in india um so you might want to check that out irrespective of the fact that whether you want to participate in the tournament or not it's a huge community over there and if you want to interact with the uh, indian community and abroad uh, i i think pvp hq is the best place to be um so let's let's just navigate through some of the basic stuff so they have uh, indian gpl leaderboard so over here all the indian players you'll find a bunch of indian players and you, you'll be able to see their current uh, current rankings as well um and then uh, they have uh, multiple formats at pvp hq where they ho- held their tournament uh, so the first thing is uh, the first tournament is star of mastery and this is my personal favorite because uh, this is basically as close as you can get to the uh, main series game format uh, at least the game format uh, so i'll not go in- into uh, the detail of the star of mastery because this this video is specifically for uh, the next uh, tournament in the list which is uh, the battle frontier so battle frontier is a multi state city versus city team tournament for Martin Pokemon Go and has been running for over 2 years to battle it out for the title of the best PvP city in India so as as uh, the description accurately mentions that uh, it's a city v city tournament uh, wherein uh, a lot of indian cities uh, and city players uh, participate and uh, they go head to head against each other and uh, this season also uh, the format is likely to remain uh, the format not likely but format is the same that uh, i i think it's there are a total of six players uh, needed for uh, 
for this particular tournament and out of those six players five players have to be, have to belong to the same city whereas you can have the six player which is uh, which is outside your city or uh, maybe even a uh, e- even outside india if that uh, uh, if if you can get someone from uh, from there so it's it's a nice way to balance out uh, things because sometimes having a lot of foreigner players uh, and by foreigner i mean outside outside indian players uh, tends to get uh, uh, I think it it makes your team really uh, really favorite to win and uh, doesn't really give a lot of chance to Indian players. But uh, looking at the Indian players' performance this season, I think uh, the Indian players are ready to get to toe to toe with uh, with the other players. That uh, with the other, I, I think Indian players are ready to go global. We I don't really consider anybody to be uh, lesser or more than uh, any 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 other basically player in the world. So uh, they they host a bunch of other self tournament as well, and they have uh, teams at self factions. Uh, so three teams are there: HQ, Dukes and Kongs, Pika Blinders HQ, and uh, Delhi Dam Anadens HQ, which is my current self factions. Um, so coming back to the registration, so if I go ahead and log into HQ, uh, since my profile has already been there, I would be able to log in as uh, Sidby. Um, so uh, I don't need to set up my profile, uh, but if you are a new user, you will be prompted to uh, set up your profile here. Um, So if I go ahead and see my profile, uh, you'll see a bunch. You, you'll see a very nice graphic here, and I think Sai, who is uh, who is the owner of PVP HQ, is looking to add a bunch of new features to this thing. And once you once you do, I think it's. Uh, I, I think once he does, it's going to be. It's going to be probably. It's going to look very nice. I, I mean, I'm I'm at a loss of words. Um, so here you can see my trainer code, uh, which probably I should have kept hidden. Uh, but the GBL season, uh, the current GBL season is here. Uh, my current MMR and uh, the highest MMR. Uh, so I, I'll just do it for uh, the science purpose or or whatnot. So I'll just increase my MMR uh, by one uh, because it doesn't really make a difference to the leaderboard, and I don't want to be true to it. Uh, so as you can see, my highest MMR has has already been. Changed uh, to three three one four and the current MMR as well. Whereas if I uh, go ahead and uh, do this, uh, update my latest MMR, um, it, it's taking a bit of uh, it's taking a bit of time. But uh, as you can see, my current MMR is updated and the same will be reflected in the Indian GBL leaderboard as well. And uh, if you don't want to do it from here, they have a really nice Discord board which uh, which will do all the job for you. Uh, so coming back to the things, I think I'm getting way too sidetracked here. But uh, the, when Sai showed me this, I was pretty excited for this, and I thought that might as well include it, include it in this video. Um, so if you go ahead and go to Battle Frontier, uh, so again. You uh, here instead of uh, the team page. You, if you are a captain, uh, you will be prompted to uh, register your team. And once you do, uh, you will be asked to. Uh, I, I think you can, you you just need to place uh, the the battle set. Uh, uh, not battle set, but. You need to put in your team name. Uh, so, say for instance, my team name is Battle Sid. So, I'll be able to view this information here. And as you can see, there's a crown in front of it because I'm the captain, or supposedly captain. Uh, so, here, uh, the one thing once you register your tournament, and if you uh, once you register for the tournament, and if you are the captain in DT, uh, you'll need to invite uh, five more players to uh, to to your team. And uh, how you are going to do that? You are, you will have to do by uh, by sending them an invite. So here you would have to enter uh, their IGN, uh, which will be their in-game name, and that has to be uh, similar to what they have registered while setting up the pro- while setting up their profile. So uh, I- I'm not sure whether uh, whether I'll be able to get. Uh, like this, uh, you know, th- whether I'll be able to get to invite Sai or not, because he might, may or may not have uh, been successfully. Uh, he, he, I mean, uh, whether he has or has not updated his details, I'm not sure. But let's try to do that. So it says user on user not registered. So it's a prime example of uh, say if the user has not registered, I, or I mean, if the player who you who you want to invite is not registered, so you'll be able to see that. Um, let's try to invite myself if he allows to do. 
so yeah use it already in a team so you will not be able to invite someone who's already in a team uh, so let's try to invite nava and by 00 Okay, so seems like this also. I I, I think this uh, I, I got an early access to uh, this website, so a lot of players are not uh, not registered to it. But anyway, uh, people will get to know once they get to know about this. So once you do that, uh, sorry, I went to the wrong page. So once you do that, you will be you go to Battle Frontier page and you will be able to see your team name. And uh, then again, you, if you go to the team page, uh, you will be able to see uh, once uh, as soon as the players start getting uh, start, you know, uh, uh, accepting their invite, uh, you will be able to see their profile here. Kind uh, sort of similar to what Silk Faction already has, uh, but but I, I think you'll, you you get the gist here. And uh, once you register your team, uh, you will also need to submit your team logo. And uh, if once you do that, uh, this Battle Frontier logo will be replaced by uh, the team's logo. So, um, so another cool thing. And if you if you want uh, if you want to catch hold of Sai in order to make the team logo, I think he will be able to do that happily. He loves to do uh, uh, photo editing and stuff. So, uh, I, I I think he'll be more than happy to happy to do do that. Uh, so let's go to some of the Indian leaderboards now. Uh, so as you can see, Nava Empire, who probably uh, I think if you are from Indian PVP community, you know who the guy is, and uh, he's probably one of the best, uh, if not the best PVP player of the country. So uh, you can see a bunch of players are here uh, who have already registered. These are certainly not all. Um, but yeah a lot of people and by me a lot i mean a lot of people have reached legend this season and and i'm particularly excited about the indian community um so so yeah that's uh, that's pretty much it and uh, i would be looking forward to uh, seeing you guys in the battle frontier tournament season 6 clip hanger and if you want to know more about the tournament uh, make sure to check out uh, the their link the disc, their discord server i'll uh, mention the link to their discord server and the website in the description down below so do make sure to check that out and especially if you are from india i think if you are from india and you love pvp pvp hq is the place to be apart from battle sets server of course so um so yeah that's it for this video guys i hope you find that informative and uh, it certainly motivate some of you to join the tournament and uh, yeah if uh, or i forgot one thing so if you are a player uh, who, who want to participate in the tournament i think as of now the best best possible thing that you can do is you can uh, go to their uh, discord server and interact with some of the team captains i think once the once the team starts uh, registering i think there will be a channel for or there will be a path where in uh, the players who wish to participate in the, in the tournament can contact uh, can contact their respective uh, team uh, respective city team captains Uh, and since it's a city to city tournament uh, you will only be able to participate in the uh, in in the city where you uh, where you belong from where you belong and if you want to play as in uh, as in uh, uh, how i do i put it in a very decent way as an outside player outside city player uh, then the chances or the seats will be limited because there is only one slot available per team so uh, make sure to grab that slot as as soon as you can and uh, yeah finally uh, until next time have a nice day